Hey y'all, it's A Nose back at it again. I just wanted to show y'all how to run the Gran Turismo 5 on firmware 3.41. Um, I'm about to show y'all that I'm on 3.41. Some information 3.41 back up. The multi man, you definitely got to make sure that it's a game in there that you see Gran Turismo 5. I'm going to put champions in. As you see, the champions will load up. Okay, sports champions is in the disc. Click OK. All right. Go to the disc, click OK, and make sure that you jailbreak your PS3 um, payload harms 4B. Okay. And the graphics is sick on this. There you go. So there you go, Gran Turismo 5, running on 3.41. But I'm going to show y'all how to do it. Let's go to the computer. All right. It's just three things you have to do. Documents PS3. Okay. So first you want to do is download the game. <laughs> That's the first thing you're gonna do. Second thing you're gonna do is you're gonna edit the param.sfo file, which is right here. So you open this up, click OK. Click OK. PlayStation 3 System File Editor. So we're going to go to Load. You see that? The param.sfo file. You click OK. Then you'll see that it says Gran Turismo 5. You go to Advanced Edit. Okay, right here, it will say PS3 System Version. And then with y'all version, it'll say 3.5000. You want to go ahead and change that to 3.4100. Then click OK. X that out. Then you want to go ahead and click Save on that. Boom. If you're going to want to put the game straight into your hard drive, the external hard drive, you're going to want to have to use this program called Open Split. Because in the game file, I'm going to show you right here, PS3 game, 
USRDIR. This file right here, GT dot volume. The total of the value is going to be 11 gigs, so you're going to have to split that for you to put it on your external hard drive. If you just going to FTP your, the game, then you ain't got to worry about that. All right. And then third, you will have to change the eboot.bin. All you have to do is just Google it because I don't have the link. Just Google eboot.bin fix for Gran Turismo 5. And you just go ahead and change that. And that's it. You're, you're done. I hope I was helpful. And uh, next week I will be showing the um, PS3 running on the custom firmware, the 3.55. Um, the PS3 hack is improving every day. With the custom firmware, you're going to be able to play the games online. Um, be able to go into your PSN. And with no problems. So um, I'm going to give it a week. Because for right now. You cannot run the uh, backups. You have to make your game. Make your game like a PSN game. So the PS3 will think that it's a PSN game. And then it'll run. I don't want to do all that. So I'm going to just wait until. The uh, backup manager. Is uh, ready to go with that. So alright y'all. Peace. Till next week, I holla. One.